Hey YouTubers, how's it going? This is Dave. Uh, I am on my way to get the car washed. You surprise. Um, been doing a lot of work in the garage the last few days. Got uh, the one section of it uh, surprisingly well cleaned. Uh, I'm not making as much progress as I wanted to over the last couple days. I am on vacation, like I, I may have mentioned. Um, what I'm actually ending up doing uh, was, was tore out one of the uh, shelves that I had in there. Got rid of a bunch of stuff that I had, moved some things over, been cleaning, been mounting some new uh, lights, been cleaning off my benches. I'm going to be transferring a bunch of stuff over from the tables in there so I can move all the stuff forward. I like to try to get this car in the garage uh, by tomorrow. It's looking like really crappy weather tomorrow. Uh, looking like rain. Uh, then we're going to have Thursday, Friday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday look decent for the shore. Uh, and then um, I think Saturday's looking like a bigger chance of rain. And then Sunday's rain. And then Monday, the day we go home, is a nice day again. So go figure. Uh, but it's the way it goes. You know, I, I'm not at work, so it could be worse. Um, but I did get a lot done in the, in the garage, and uh, I'll be taking some video of that later on tonight. Uh, hopefully within the next couple of weeks, I should be getting some better uh, video equipment, because uh, to date, all I've been doing is taking these videos with my iPhone, um, and it's on a magnetic mount uh, here, so. Uh, but uh, just quick update, the uh, car is starting to pull again. It looks like they did get the part in, but now they're not gonna be able to get me in until next Tuesday, which is fine, because I'm gonna be down the shore. Uh, during that time anyway, so it's not the end of the world um, On the car front I did order up a few more parts for the cutlass and I should have that for the fuel pump um, the, I'm sorry the fuel filter mount. It's a, a spring-loaded mount uh, for the I think it's a uh, Aeromotive 12 304 uh, I think 100 micron filter uh, For the fuel injection systems mounted in the trunk, so I'll have that taken care of uh, that should be here some either today or tomorrow, hopefully. If not, it's going to be sitting for a while, so I'll, I'll probably ask the person who uh, is watching our cats to uh, pick that up uh, and bring it into the house. But um, still love this car. Uh, probably going to end up doing something stupid with it at some point, but I was hoping to get to the track um, on Friday. That didn't work out because of the weather. Uh, I'm sorry, not the weather, but uh, my wife gave me a list of stuff to do. And um, ended up uh, couldn't take both boys and run at the track uh, with both boys in the back. So <laughs> that's uh, just a smidgen irresponsible. So, uh, but I hopefully will have most of the stuff uh, moved from my uh, staging table over to the uh, shelf. Uh, I guess my workbench later on this evening. I hope to stay up for a while. I'm off all week, so. I'm hopefully going to get a lot more done in there. I was hoping to do some work down my basement, but that just didn't happen. So I'm going to take, I might take Thanksgiving week off too, just to get a break, uh, get another break in there. And then I'm taking a week of Christmas off uh, in between Christmas and New Year's. Um, but uh, I'll hopefully be able to get all that uh, stuff done this uh, next couple days and um, be back up and running on the Cutlass. Uh, I'm going to be ordering up some brake lines. I'm going to get the nickel, chrome, uh, nickel copper lines that are easy to, easier to bend. Uh, and um, the uh, two, two fittings. If you uh, follow uh, Hot Rod TV on, online, uh, you can... I, I, I'm not exactly with the searches. I think it's... Uh, um, I think if you just look up... Um, custom custom brake lines or something like that it's one of the first ones to pop up but uh, I had planned to do that for a while so this is just gonna give me the opportunity to finally go and get that and take care of it I'm gonna start working on the back end um, I'll be chronicling that as well just working on the um, which we call it the the uh, rear disc brakes the Z06 brakes so I'll, I'll get that taken care of probably within the next uh, few weeks not not this week obviously because I don't plan to be working on any of that stuff anytime soon but um, hopefully within the next uh, month I'll have that done because I, I really do want to start getting that car out in the better weather I haven't put a heater in it yet but I do have space to do that so within the next month or so I'll be making some really good progress on that I'm sorry for constantly putting these videos out but uh, you know I just want to give you an update you know I'm not sitting around doing nothing but uh, I really do want to start getting moving because there's been some really good questions 
on the engine <laughs> yeah how much did it put down well not much because <laughs> uh, not much because it has moved <laughs> so it's been a bit of quite a few years in the making of doing this it's just I, I work on it when I have the time but I do want to get it um, going because I'm planning on also get the motor up and running get it driving um, then I'm gonna get the, the plate the spacer plate with the uh, nitrous in it and um, if you go take a look at Guitar Armageddon ZL1, he has that on his, uh, the guys at, uh, well, Andy at Diablo Formula Racing, he did my transmission for the uh, Cutlass. Uh, he did, he's done a, quite a few transmissions, so give him, take a look at his YouTube channel, it's uh, Diablo Formula Racing, and um, the guys, um, damn it if I forgot his name, <laughs> but, but he's, uh, the, he has a really awesome ZL1. Uh, it is Guitar again ZL1. Uh, look at his channel. He's got some really awesome videos there. Uh, it's funny because a few last year around this time, I was getting my transmission built by Andy, and at that time he had just uh, gotten in a bred ZL1 that he was working on, and um, flash forward one year, and he's a uh, he's a big hit on YouTube, and he, he does some pretty kick-ass work. So I definitely recommend uh, Andy. He's a, he does really nice work, he's a real nice guy, and um, if you need anything, he's out in a Frada PA, so I'm um, here at the um, car wash, uh, stay tuned, I'll have another video tonight, give you a shot of the of the basement, a uh, basement, of the, of the um, I'm working on that too, I'm trying to finish that, that didn't happen, but um, of the garage, show you what's going on there, and um, give you another look at some of the stuff that I have. Uh, it's been hiding in the garage for the uh, cutlass. So uh, please subscribe and any questions, please ask. Thanks a lot, guys.